Hello everyone, as you can see here, this is Dell Inspiron 15 5000 series. Recently we got issue with the charging port. Okay, so DC port is completely gone. As you can see, there are a lot of physical damage in here. I can bring into the focus. What are you going to do? I'm going to show you how to replace it. So let's start. So first of all, what do you need to do? Turn it off. Take out all the screw that you can see with your Phillips screwdriver. Okay. So as you can see, there are a couple of screws missing because of this is all gone. But anyway, whatever is left over, we're going to open up. So now these two I'm not going to open right now because this one need to open up from the front not from the back so make sure put it in 90 degree angle and then take it out all right so now spudgery with any flat opening tools like that this is broken so I must need to be careful otherwise it's gonna break completely So the back lid should come up like this. See, too much dust in there. So that's the actual machine. Now, there is the charging port which is under this hinges okay so first we need to remove the hinge I mean open the hinge to get access access to the charging port but the problem is if you open only one hinge what about the other because these are kind of parallel so we need to open up together so if you want to do this job nice and smoothly without any trouble then it's going to take a little bit of time because you must need to remove this panel separate it from the screen panel and then we can take this out okay so before we start anything we're going to check which way is gone okay the good point is we don't need to remove this unit completely why because we can open one and pull out this one and we can change that one without opening every single thing so first is first before you do anything, disconnect your charger, I mean, sorry, the battery connector, which is that one. And then second option is this. Okay, keep it a little bit upright, little bit, not too much. And then take out all the screws from the hinges. One. Two. I will tell you why you left why you keep it this 40 degree angle because now easily we can open it open the hinge in that way 90 degree and then get access to the DC port this DC port connected to this bottom with one screw so unscrew it first okay once it unscrewed, then take this out. That's the actual DC port. You see? I think I got the replacement. Okay. 
All right, this flex is like little bit longer. Let's check if the connector is same or not. The connector is absolutely same, so that's fine. I think we can fit it. Yeah. I we'll put this one first in here. Okay. Now this cable is a little bit longer but that's not a problem because we can fix it. So we can close it in that way. Yeah. All right, so if you get this sort of problem, like you know, I ordered the exactly same one with the item number, but which one I received is a little bit longer with the same connector and same port. So you got two options either to get the short one, but if you get longer, what you can do, you can just do the cable management. As you can see now, this is one. Let's do it in that way. You see? It's perfect. Okay, yeah. It's gonna be fit 100% now. Yeah. Done. It's completely fitted now. We need to put rest of the screws. This might be goes in here. Let's check it out. Okay, so that's how you replace the charging port for Dell Inspiron 15 5000 series. It's super simple. There are two uh, types of replacement. One of them with the short cable, another one the longer. If you have the shorter one, it's much better. But imagine it, if you need the longer one and if you order the shorter one, then that would be a problem. You can't get enough length to reach to this port i mean to the motherboard connector or either the charging port so make it a balance first double check before you place a order and if you still do have any question feel free to leave it in the comment section i hope i will see you in the next video guys bye for now thank you